Hey everybody, here with another episode of Endless Super Expert No Skips in Mario Maker 2. Uh, if you are perceptive, then you may notice I have a new microphone. It should be much higher quality, but we're still working out the kinks of getting things, settings and everything, so uh, let me know how it sounds. Let's go. Alright, we are doing the Endless Super Expert Challenge, no skips allowed. The goal is to beat 8 levels without running out of lives. If we do, we win. If not, we lose. And if we get to 8, we just keep going. How, when, and where? 20 seconds. <clears throat> oh. This is like an abstract speedrun level. There's like... I don't really... This is weird. Okay. If you're wondering, my mic... The new mic I got, it's a Shure SM7B. I believe that's the model. And uh, I got a Go XLR mixer as well to... Adjust the sound. Uh, that's pretty cool. I had, shoot, I had the same microphone for about over five years, the Blue Yeti, so this is my first XLR mic, and I think the quality's much better. Um, my voice might sound a little different, and that's due to the compression settings, but um, the, the voice quality should be much higher. I can't make that one for some reason. I don't know why. There we go. <laughs> Dude, I jumped too high. Uh, these jumps are not free. I mean, it's not that hard of a level, but... Oh, man. I think it's harder than it was. literally no way to react to that. Actually, I don't even know if you can see that by the camera may have been covering it up. But essentially, I came out of the door and I had to hold jump or else I'd die. Nice. Okay, I'm holding jump. That's all I had to do. Okay. Uh, that was cool. Um, kind of an abstract speed run. It didn't need indicators, you could just kind of tell where you had to go. It was pretty cool, although the ending was unfair. But, uh, I'm trying to make sure I don't, like, I want to have more commentary during the run, but I'm trying my best to, like, keep in mind that I don't want to show repeat sections over and over and over. But I was saying, the Go XLR, it's really cool. It's a mixer, um... And it's very good for adjusting how your voice sounds, but it also has a few silly things. Like, I can make myself sound like this. Level 2. Level two. <laughs> Champions Road Remake. <clears throat> I don't remember the beginning looking like this. Okay, so that's a mess. I had to make sure I turned that off. It sounds really weird. Oh my goodness, how unlucky. And this version of Champions on Road, Champions on Road, Champions Road is kind of unfair. Dude, uh, I should have just went slow. I should be patient more often uh, during these challenges. That was a bad death. This beginning is chaos, man. There's too many. Ah, oh, here we go. That is... <laughs> There's too many hammer bros. Also, it got really hot in here. I needed to take my jacket off. <clears throat> oh, 
That's what I mean. I need to be patient. That could have been another one. Just take it slow. Such a bad way to die, man. So I can get one up here, too. Well, I almost got them. Ugh, man, there are a lot of enemies in this level. I would love a checkpoint. I don't think I'm gonna get one, though. Here's this part. You just... Oh, shoot. It's weird that one of them was, uh... This whole being patient thing is kind of paying off. Maybe I should do it more often. Um... I just, I really want a checkpoint, please. Okay, this one. oh god. Okay. Oh no, this is something. Take this. Ooh, going through a one tile diagonal gap like that, nowhere near as hard as a vertical one, but it's still, it's pretty scary. Okay. Okay. What is this? Oh, the boost part. That means this is the end of the level, right? was definitely scary. Way harder than it could have been. It was mostly that first room. The, uh, the fire hammer bro things. Those were rough. Level 3. La Cueva del Michi. 3D World. Well, I should have known it was 3D World from the level preview, but same theme, but like jungle or whatever. Forest. I think it's called Forest. Um, so really quick, I wanted to address I did not have, well I did have a video Saturday, you were there within the first hour or so, you would have seen it. If not, you would not have seen it. Um, people were asking about it, I made a post on my community tab about it, but uh, I used to not know the community tab existed. Apparently it's a lot of um, Community posts show up on mobile, but on desktop you need to physically go to my channel. Anyway, I just wasn't happy with some of the commentary. Specifically, I made some comments about Ryukar and his recent videos. And uh, we're not like speaking or something. I 
messaged him privately about it and like, he's cool. We're, we're still friends, I just did something stupid. And like, it wasn't that big of a deal, but the issue is, like I said, the video had only been up for about an hour and there were some really negative comments. And not like, not like, oh my god, if people think I'm a jerk or something. People were being very rude to Ryu in my comments and not, like, about what I said. They started, like, attacking him as a person and things like that. And that's not okay. I don't tolerate that. I have a zero tolerance policy for it in my stream, and I don't want it in my comments either. And so I just felt the best thing to do was delete the video. Um, but yeah. So, you know, people may comment about it in here. If you do make comments like that, I'm going to delete them. Uh, that is not okay. Like saying things like, oh my god, I always knew he was a garbage human being. Like, don't do that, people. <laughs> it's just a video game. Anyway, I just wanted to say that. Um, okay, we gotta wait on the block. I hope we're not dead here. Uh, I don't want to get Kaizu again, man. I'm a little nervous. Once the Kaizu... Oh. Once. 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 Once you kaizo a... Oh, oh I see. Once you kaizo a player once, all trust is gone. I don't trust the creator after that, but that's your one opportunity. You know? Hey! That was scary. <laughs> that was pretty easy so far, but I like that. Move me out. Move me out. Good boy. <laughs> I'm watching good boy. Now there's a cat anyway. That I said cat. I guess YouTube. I'm used to saying cat, because, you know, I mostly live stream, I don't making videos like this I only do for these weekends. Um, anybody watching, if you guys have a cat, you say good boy or good girl or whatever. Like, I don't know why that just came out of my mouth. But, like, you know, people say that to their dog. So. Whatever. I don't, that's really weird. Anyway. Oh, also, I d forgot to mention, uh, because I deleted the video Saturday, I kind of just feel bad, and also, it's going to annoy me seeing it's been an even number every Sunday, and now it's going to be an odd. So, uh, there will be three videos this weekend. Oh no, this guy makes hard levels. This could be bad. This could be real bad, guys. Okay, so... If I press the run button and grab that pal... Um... I'll gr oh. Yeah. That happens. Oh, this is unfortunate. How do you even do this, man? How did that happen? Oh, is this cheese? Maybe we can cheese it. Because I, okay. I'm a little confused. Ah, see, I don't know. Maybe that's a really tough jump. I'm not really even sure what the tech here is. I think this is the play. Okay, good. 
good, good. What is this? I grab one of these pals, see that shell? It's gonna activate the P switch and then I'll lose. This is something. Yeah, see this cannon would have uh, blocked the path. interesting setup. Um, there's probably blocks moving along the top of the screen currently, and if I were to run, you'll, I think, I think that's the setup. You'll see here at the end, unless that's not it, then I don't know why I can't run. Okay, I don't know why I can't run. I did hold run there at the end. I'm not sure what was going on in that other room. That was kind of neat. Um, there is a thing, I've seen it in a Mario Maker 1 level, where if you run, you lose. And there would be like winged blocks on a track above. And somehow it's... Oh my goodness. This might be over. This is over. Is it over? Um, I think it's over. Shoot. Oh, dude. I don't know what to do, man. Um, but yeah, that set up the winged blocks. They'll block your path if you run. So somehow you have to walk. I don't know what to do, man. These F makes really hard item abuse levels. I'm... I don't know, because I'm not going to collect this red coin. I need to, uh... I need to use the shell to collect it, I think. But I don't see how you do that. Ugh, this is like a puzzle, man. I don't know what to do. <laughs> well, shoot. This sucks. I need to get the shell over there, um, but I just don't, I don't know the order of juggling. Alright, well, let's check the clear rates. 0 0.45, 0 0.55. First two levels were kind of tough. 6.25, 2.89. Oh, apparently I've played this before. <laughs> 0.72. Okay, I just found a video on Jayzif's Twitter. Um, so I will, uh, show you how to do it. It's actually not that hard. So see how that spring keeps, uh... That spring keeps hitting the other spring? I don't want that. There we go. 
It's not too bad. I think that took maybe 20 tries or so. So I think I would have gotten a game over, even if I knew what to do. I don't like looking up clear vids during the run. It's just... I try to use as little external help as possible, you know? Alright, we only got four clears, so I'm gonna do four uncleared levels. I will do... Oh wait, no, I don't do that anymore. I'm getting them off the uncleared sheet. Uh, in this first one... <laughs> it is titled, Is Wind a Jank? <laughs> says, no, it's reliable, unlike my husband. Uh, I, don't, I just think that's funny. Okay. I don't, I will admit, what the heck, a checkpoint. I will admit, I do not like the wind effect. Where's the wind? Oh, okay. Uh, it's only blowing left. I don't know if I knew that it did that. That was unfortunate. I need to wait out the wind here. Oh, I need the wind. Okay. I gotcha. Alright, let's wait on the wind. Let's not wait on the wind. I tried to time it, dang it. There we go. Why did that take so long? Okay. Ah, let's go. Alright, that wasn't half bad. I mean, I just uh, don't like the nighttime wind, but as far as using it, that was a pretty good use of it, I feel. Well done. <clears throat> hard world. I made this hard. Well, alrighty then. I just realized this is two SMD1. Well, I didn't. I kind of choose these randomly off the list. Um, so. <laughs> it was just coincidence. Oh, this trick. Not that hard of a jump. Like, it looks like it would be a jump that's extremely tight, but it's pretty lenient. Like, it's not, like, easy, but. There's, there's a good bit of room for error. Oh wait, that's optional. Ooh, what is this? Oh, okay, there's no- I thought I had to go straight to that one on the right. I was like, there's no way, man. Glad they put those, uh, secondary switches to, like, shoot, so that you don't have to get it in one try. If you're curious what I'm doing, I guess I should explain it. It's just jumping into that, and you kind of clip in, and you're considered as standing for... Oh, come on! You're considered as standing for uh, maybe, like, four frames or so, It's which... It's not that long of a time, but as far as the timing-based trick it is, like, it's not that hard. Most of you watching, if you just practiced it for a bit, you could do it. You see that? It's not activating the second switch. There it did. What the heck? That's so weird. There we go. That one's kind of hard. 
Hesitate, dude. That was so bad, man. Ugh. Just go. Do not hesitate. At least in Kaiza, when you're in just like a normal level. Sometimes being safe is the play. Okay. down there, Claw. Okay, that's the end. It's not too bad. Like I said, that trick's a lot easier than it looks. Like, a shell jump's harder than that, so... Not bad. Alright, let's check this out. Fun time in the snow, Kaizo. Have fun with the level. Don't forget your winter jacket. I actually really hate snow, and it... Uh, this is... Oh, I have been saying when I record this. This is being recorded January 17th. It snowed an incredible amount yesterday. I, God, I hate the snow. <laughs> oh, I can't stand it. My car is just like... Like, so much snow on it, I just don't want to deal with it. Okay. I see now. Snow, if you live somewhere where there's no snow, be thankful. You're not missing out. Like, you see snow on TV, and it's like this fluffy, powdery, fun stuff. And that's all, that's a lie. Okay. Snow gets like cold, it gets packed, it just becomes ice. Not fun. longer yeah, wait a little longer there oh okay Blocking the path. Uh, I could have made that. I needed to jump. Uh, okay. Finally, man. That was the end of the level, too. I got stuck there. It wasn't that long. I got stuck there for like. Five minutes or so. Oh yeah, let me test this. Uh, my uh, Go XLR can make that noise as well. I don't know what the volume was like though. So hopefully it wasn't too loud. All right, and finally, let's check this out. It appears to be a 50 second speed run. How hard could it be? <clears throat> Pretty hard. Not 
Why coin trail, man? It's louder than a jet engine. Coins in SMB1 and SMB3 are just so loud. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, shoot. I think I could have ran under the angry sun there. Yeah. Whoa, dude. How did I not die there? Oh, the flump bounce. Interesting. That was really bad. Alright, do not, if you don't do whatever I did, that was just really bad. <laughs> okay. That was pretty chill, that was like an expert level. The uncleared levels on the list aren't sorted by their difficulty or anything, so sometimes you get an easier one. But, nice. Alright, that wraps up this episode. Thank you for watching. Uh, the run, it was kind of tough. It started out tough, and then we got that juggle level that just wasn't our day. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I post one of these every Saturday and Sunday at 9 a.m. Eastern, so subscribe if you want to see more. And, yeah. See you next time.